Hello, welcome. Namron here. We are doing a short video on lava, the current best legendary element that you can acquire. Um, out of all of the legendaries, we have dragon, angel, gravity, and lava. Uh, currently, the I really like dragon. I know a lot of people don't like dragon as much. I just I like the feel of dragon. I don't mind the dot damage that it does, the damage over time. Um, but lava is a very, very nice ability. It has a lot of everything with it. So we are going to get started here. I have my controller ready. We do have all of the abilities unlocked. Uh, as you can see, I accidentally summoned my little minions. They're doing 1800 per hit. Since there's three of them, that's 1800 times three. A nice little 5400 5400 damage each time they hit an enemy uh, now we're going to go ahead and just launch this here I didn't even see the damage there we got a nice big chunk there that's fine uh, that should be ready yep 6623 nice little chunk now do keep in mind I do have the four celestial set so that's going to be boosting my damage a bit as well as these little trinkets here which are boosting me even further um, now if I take those off let's go ahead and take this off oh we just spent a bunch of gold didn't we no we don't we didn't have enough gold unequip okay you see my health drop down to a hundred all right so now they are doing Twelve hundred, by the looks of it. Okay, let's go ahead and do this. Them reapers are in the way. Fine, I'll just do it this way. Forty-six ninety. Okay, so that is a nice big chunk of damage that we just lost because of our armor. Um, that is to be expected, though, since it is boosting us. Let's go ahead and equip that back. Let's go ahead and make sure this is locked. Equip that again. And equip that again. All right, we have our health back up. Let's find our trinkets. And equip those. So we gained about 2,000 damage on this. And about four or 500 damage on the minions. Maybe 600, somewhere on there. Uh, let's go ahead and go to the next attack. We are doing 4,000 per hit on the barrage there. And that one has a nice knockback. It, do, it does help keep smaller enemies at bay. Helps knock them back and keep them away from us. Has decent range. If you can see it goes... It, the range is somewhat medium to short, long range. Uh, it does... Like, it won't reach way over there, like Dragon's abilities, where it'll shoot the eye way over there or clear across the map. It won't go that far. Um, same with this one. This one kind of... The range on this is... It's not as close as Phantom, but it's further than... Um, I'd say Phantom, essentially. Much further than Phantom. But not nearly as far as, like, Light or Dragon. Uh, now... We have our minions out. Let's see. Magma phase. This. Now this is going to be our dash. It does apply a burn, which takes for 15, 20. I didn't see the initial hit damage because of the positioning of the camera. Uh, but we can try to see it again. 75, 17. That's what I saw there. I'm not sure if that was ours or not. 75, 17. Plus the dot damage. It takes for a few seconds. So does a decent amount of damage now you do want to be careful when using it because you can be hurt with it now the final ability the most powerful ability it has is this one now it's only doing 3,000 damage per hit but if I zoom out here it has decent size range and it's cooldown as soon as it ends it's very close to being able to go right back up you can walk around with it. You can use your other abilities with it. You can dash with it. 
if you had it out right there. Uh, actually, if we do it now and go dash, now we're going to be getting even more damage to go up. So let's go ahead and go into Hardcore Atlantis. Uh, it's the highest dungeon level I have unlocked currently with my level at 166. We might die. The enemies here do hit very hard. But yes, we, we do die quite frequently at times. Um, I was leveling it up a little bit off stream last night to get the final levels for the ability. Um, I will max it out and see how well it does at 300. Um, in my opinion, it's not going to be nearly as good as anything like Galaxy, for example. And we're going to summon. We're going to do a quick dash get their attention let the minions finish those guys off the minions do die very easily against certain enemies you'll see that here go ahead and grab his aggro that's fine grab this to sell it hello i love you too no you <laughs> Kids are adorable. I love my kids. All right, you see their combination of the mobs and the dash was able to take those out fairly easily. Gonna use this. Now, this is not big boss damage level. It's not anything like Phantom. It's more similar to Galaxy, just at a lower level than Galaxy is, essentially. We're going to grab his attention as well as the guy behind him. All of them, apparently. Oh, crap. That's going to hurt. Summon our guys back. All right. I should be using this. But one thing I do have an issue with is I cannot see things he is doing so I don't know if he okay oh Ooh. somehow we did not die using that um, this ability as you can see makes it very difficult to see AOEs that the bosses are doing so you can and will likely get hit by something it will hurt, so you need to be very careful. I, I don't know if they... I would like to see if they have a setting to turn those off. If they don't, I think they need to add one. Because... And that's my next criticism on this. Just like Galaxy and any of these movement abilities, it's very easy to essentially get stuck when trying to use it. Hi. All right, we got another potion handy. Oh crap, that's... Now, I have had another issue with the dodge, or not the, the dash, randomly at times. I will go the opposite direction. So let's say I'm going forward, just like that. That actually showed it exactly. Uh, it randomly goes the wrong direction. I don't know why. I don't know if it's an issue with my controller. Uh, I, I do play on PC, but I use the Xbox Pro controller. And for some reason, when I use that on this controller, I've been getting that issue lately. If you noticed on stream where I was doing that, uh, I've been having that problem. All right, now we are gonna use this here. Finish off these guys. As you can see, it, it lasts a nice duration. It does allow you to travel with it. You can combine it with your dash, like I showed you before. I haven't really implemented that into my rotation yet. I'm still getting used to the feel of it currently. Uh, gonna finish this guy off here, and we're gonna move on to the next area. You see how fast it destroys these mobs. It's great for mob clearing. 
uh, just like Galaxy is great for mob clearing. Won't be so great for boss damage. At least not quick boss damage. That is also a very easy miss attack. Here we are positioned perfectly to be able to damage these guys. Do some damage. We lost our summon, so let's bring them back out. This is one of the mobs that can kill them easily. That attack typically kills them. I think we just lost two actually. So that that does show exactly what I'm saying, that they die very easily. Kill these guys here. Summon again. We just lost them again, you see? Just like uh, Reaper, your summons can die very easily. All right, we're leveling up. Let's summon. Hit these guys, knock them out. We could be using our barrage attack. I think we're gonna save it for these guys here. Hit you, hit you. You can see the range on it. It's Decent. It's nothing amazing like light or dragon. Oh, that could have been bad. All right, we're going to use this. Oh, I didn't even see their attacks. You see how easy that is to die, but um, let's try to get another run and get to the boss. Hey, that is one of the main drawbacks of this. If you're alone, you, you really need to pay attention. Um, once this is loaded, I'm going to see if we have anything for VFX. As much as I like the effects and seeing them, UIS effects ability zero. Let's take a look at that. Oh, speaking of which, we did get the top 1000 spear, which is nice. I like it. Okay, uh, let's go back to settings. What are these four? This. I don't know. Um, the the really we really need a way of fixing this. I guess not. Well, I'll just put this back to basic, I guess. Really wish that we had a way to disable this particular ability or what we see here I got stuck in the, the beginning there the, really wish they would fix some of these doors how you get stuck on them even after they are gone uh, we might have pressed it a bit too soon maybe button I don't know if Okay, I see that we are almost done. Good, good. Grab the potion. We have another potion we can grab right there. Those will come in handy as long as you don't get one shot. And as this levels up more, it's gonna kill things faster for me. So things that do attack while that duration is up, they will die faster. Excuse me. Needed a drink. I just got off work recently. Now, I do also want to mention uh, something here regarding the channel. I'm going to be doing a giveaway for the game here. Uh, next Saturday is when I plan on doing it. He's going to attack. It wasn't quite yet done. What? I said pick it up.
That was stupid. Did we just get hit again? We're about to die again just from being stupid. Oh my god, we went the wrong direction again. Alright. Well, we managed to stay alive even though we were being an idiot, but... Yep. Uh, now let's go ahead and zoom on through. Let's grab as many of them as we can. Let's try to keep our distance from them. Make sure we can finish them off. I think my minions are dead. There they are. Uh, we can use Magma Cloud again. Finish these guys off. Go over here. Never mind, we're going to dash the wrong way. You see what I mean by that dash? It can be very problematic. If you're trying to dash a certain direction. And for whatever reason, it dashes the wrong way. Uh, we'll be trying to report that bug to the devs that way they can hopefully fix it if someone hasn't already reported it I'll send them a link to the this video here and that way they can see exactly what is going on with that um, let's bring some of these guys over we're going to use this and try to dash that way good it worked that time I'm not sure why it does that but it is working for the most part. We're going to use this, finish these last off. Uh, we're using the dash mainly as a way to jump forward and kill them quicker. Use that, get the aggro there, and voila, they will finish them off. And we can go on over, jump over, move down. Let's go ahead and grab it again. Go forward, hit these guys. I'm gonna finish these ones off here. Let my minions take care of you. Some of my new ones, since they are dead. Completely missed that attack, that's fine. There we go. That's gonna hurt a bit. We don't have any more potions. Oh crap, he's still alive. Uh, he's hiding now. Of course you are. Let's go ahead and use this, finish him off. Grab you, you, let my minions take care of the rest. Hopefully we get a potion. Nope, nope, nope. All right, we're going to go around this way this time. Uh, I'm going to zoom forward, grab these guys. By doing it this way, I'm also getting more levels here. The more levels I get, the faster I can clear these. Um... Let's go ahead and use this. I'm going to zoom that way. I was trying to avoid getting that hit there. Now we're going to use that again here and zoom through them. Doing damage while also finishing them off. I pressed the wrong button there. We're going to hit him. We're going to keep our distance. And we're going to zoom right through. Now we're going to use this. Maybe not. I couldn't tell if it was using it or not. Okay. Uh, we have that ready so we can just dash over. All right. We managed to stay alive. There we go. We can see it now. Oh, that's going to hurt. Well. Oh. Finish them off. Summon. They're likely dead. Alright. Two more right here. Main thing is. It's not necessarily. Like it can kill things fairly quickly. Mob wise. But it's not an element built to. Move very fast I think. Not like Phantom. Phantom was made to. Essentially step all of your enemies. Uh, quite literally, since it has an ability called Step, although you're not actually stepping on them, you're just getting increased movement speed. Now, we're going to zoom here, here. We're going to use Summon again. They're most likely gone. Use this. Finish them off. Use a combination of this attack, and we are done. 
Now we can move on to the final area before the boss. I'm hoping we can really showcase how well it does at handling lots of enemies at the same time. Uh, best way to do that, besides being inside infinite, is to summon multiple bosses. So, as you see here, we are kind of using its ability to just group mobs up and hit everything around it. Single target damage. Let's see if we have a boss uh, summon thing there. No, we do not. Let's go ahead and zoom over this way. This way. We completely missed him. That's fine. All right. Eliminated that guy before he could be a problem. There we go. Good, good, good. Perfect. No boss sacrificing. So we'll just do this the normal way. Now, let's just go ahead and use this here. Okay. Now, for this boss in particular, he does essentially one shot all of your minions. So they are basically useless. You can use this though. You do want to be careful with him, with his AoEs. He throws out his spears. He can do quite a bit of damage at this level. We just got hit there. We got stuck on something. Mainly because it's really hard to see. But when he does this, gives you a chance to get that barrage going. Now, we have mobs here we can use this on. We're going to summon just to help get rid of some aggro. I was trying to pick up a potion. I don't think we're able to do so. Summon again. Keep the mobs going. Alright. I believe we killed all of the... Uh, regular mobs, maybe not. Okay, no, that's one of ours. Use that. Ow. I didn't realize he was throwing until it was too late. I'm going to use another one. All right, now he is in his healing phase. Um, decent time-wise. It's nothing like Galaxy, nothing like Phantom, uh, but those are mythics. Um, this one is meant to be a bit more, I should say, I'm not sure what how to say it, uh, a bit more of a jack of all trades, master of none type of thing. And Galaxy is really good at going quickly, so is Phantom. But Galaxy is good for burst AoE damage rather than uh, big burst single target damage. Alright. We use this until he's done there. Use that again. Use this now. While he's doing that, keep our damage going. Get hit by accident. That's fine. Go ahead and finish them off here. There we go. All right. That is our first time clearing this. It took us 10 minutes. A bit longer than it, I would have hoped. Decent XP though. Really good XP. Um, light will be faster at boss damage. Um, excuse me. Maybe not AoE damage for mobs. Galaxy obviously is going to do more damage overall than lava, but it should. It's a mythic. Excuse me. Phantom is still going to be the king of boss damage, as it should be. It's that's its intention. That's the way it was designed. Um, but overall, it, it's a good ability to get if you're new. Uh, legendaries only take 10, 10k gems to make sure you grab one. So. 10k gems you can get guarantee one of these legendaries that's without any game passes so without any luck boosts um, with vip i believe it's 8k gems uh, to guarantee a legendary of course you can always go for a 
all-rounder or the damage focused ones such as lightning or lights epics are really easy to come by if you do get lucky while while phantom is still here you'll be able to get that but phantom will be gone soon then all you'll have it will be reaper and galaxy otherwise main downsides are this ability does often as you can see there it doesn't always travel very quickly if you're on the ground you may need to do a jump first using this ability it can be very difficult to see what's going on around you so it is best to zoom out uh, it can be easier to die to aoe's because you just could not see them for whatever reason the magma phase is bugged and it goes the wrong direction i don't know if that's my end or if that's the game's end what end it is um, but here i am trying to go forward and it literally he didn't even change direction he still went backwards so yeah uh, overall it is a good, great element i am quite enjoying it i am doing a considerably less amount of damage uh, if you see here i'm currently in the top three percent that's mainly because i was at work all night last night so i didn't really have time to do damage but at the same time i'm doing less damage overall so yeah otherwise uh, next Saturday, I'm going to be doing a live stream on this game, and I'm going to be doing a giveaway for uh, at least 10, at, at most 10 VIP passes uh, to viewers in the live stream. So if you are looking to get the VIP pass and you don't have Robux, you are looking to have it gifted, be sure to be there. And you... Uh, let me know how you are liking lava if you are using it yourself or what elements you prefer to use. And you have a great rest of your day. Bye bye now.